Hi, Luthien. Uh, strawberry jam or ubi jam? Mas gusto ko ubi jam eh. Kasi kaya kong ubusin ng isang 12-ounce na bottle in three days. How can you help native Filipinos if you win a Senate seat? Hi, Anka. And thank you for showing interest in indigenous people's rights and welfare. Uh, I think I'd like to be the exponent of uh, indigenous people's rights in the Senate kasi indigenous person ako. And also to educate our fellow Filipinos about the culture of indigenous peoples. Yung sarili natin, namin kaalaman, our indigenous knowledge, our own spirituality, our living in harmony with nature, at saka yung talino ng mga katutubo in terms of protecting the environment. Uh, and this can be done by uh, fighting for legislation that protect and promote the rights of indigenous peoples. What specific laws do native Filipinos need? So Senate, uh, one of the things that I'd like to push is yung IP education law, which recognizes yung mga schools of living traditions. These are IP schools. Kasi indigenous peoples have their own um, education or indigenous education or indigenous knowledge na may sariling itsura yung kanilang mga paaralan. Some indigenous tribes even have their own alphabet. Uh, meron silang sariling school year uh, and I'd like to think that uh, pwedeng i-incorporate yung indigenous arts no? whether it's songs and dances even indigenous history dun sa curriculum. So I'd like to push for depth ed to recognize itong uh, uh, schools for living traditions no, through the Indigenous Peoples Education Act. Aside from this, uh, I'd like to um, push in the Senate no, yung Indigenous Community Conserved Areas Law which recognizes yung traditional governance ng mga katutubo in protecting the biodiversity no, samot saring buhay dun sa kanilang ninunong lupa. Ted, how do we keep children from accessing video games for too long? And also, how do we keep them safe from life? Hello, Raf. Um, I'm not really in favor now of putting restrictions uh, or passing laws to restrict access of children to video games. But that's something that can be discussed no, in the Senate, of course. Pero mas kumikiling ako dun sa positive discipline. Um, providing parents and guardians the tools and skills to how to positively discipline their children uh, in managing their time uh, between video games and of course their responsibilities as school children. Uh, so I'm a proponent of the Positive Discipline Act, something that we can push uh, in the Senate. Juliana, Super Juliana, my favorite superhero, of course, the mighty Thor, me as Guardian, the mightiest of all Avengers. Of course, uh, aside from that, he, he used to support long hair, so ako, mighty Thor. I'm nine years old. I'm from Bacolod City. My question is, what can you do to help the children in this time of pandemic? Hello, Alex. Um, I'd like to push for more vaccination drives to children so that they lead more normal lives. Makabalik na sila sa school. They can enjoy the outdoors. They can meet their friends. Uh, so for education, kung kaya, let's have more face-to-face -face, uh, classes. Iba talaga kasi pag face-to-face, -face, no? I think in terms of absorption of knowledge as well as uh, taking care of their mental health. No? Kasi at least they have um, better interaction with the teachers and the classmates. No? So kung online naman, uh, let's make sure that they have gadgets. And especially in sa mga remote areas, no? let's really push for better connectivity, uh, internet access no? for those students who are living in very remote areas. Uh, and isa pa sa mga gusto kong itulak talaga is yung mental health ng mga bata. No? 
uh, especially with this pandemic, maraming stressed, maraming depressed. Yung mga may namatayan, matay yung kanilang lola, yung magulang nila, yung kapatid nila. There has to be counseling to our children uh, so that they can uh, adapt to uh, this uh, pandemic. Uh, kasi hindi nam- lang naman ngayon itong pandemic, tuloy-tuloy pa ito. No? So, uh, aside from making sure that we have uh, better schools who are equipped with uh, coping with the pandemic, kinakailangan rin sigurong more counseling, counselors sa mga schools natin to provide the children with better physical and mental health in this time of the pandemic.